Good evening, everyone. Plenty of reasons to expect a compelling contest tonight here on the French capital, Paris. We're at the Pac de Pass. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry, and sharing duties with me today, Stuart Robson. And no question, this ought to be a game that gets pulses racing. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Liverpool. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, far from the ideal pass. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma is the keeper. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar out wide. And lining up. Hang on, Derek, it's a chance here. And the keeper more than equal to it. Playing it in. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Taken short. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, here's another look at it. Certainly delivery into the box couldn't have been any better, but I don't think the keeper should be beaten in his near post quite so easily. I thought that was stoppable. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Mbappe. Van Dijk with it. Darwin Nunez. An interceptor there. Good work to deny the opportunity. And over it comes. And collected tidily. He had plenty to think about. Well, he has the measure of his man. Andrew Robertson has lost the ball. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Gives it a go. No way through. Fabinho and the quality of pass needs to be a bit better not a huge chunk of added time one minute and that is that for the first half here on the French capital I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far 
Well, Derek, he took his goal well and was a constant threat throughout that first half. I thought he showed a lot of skill to get out of tight situations and he had a real impact on the play. Interesting 90 minutes ahead of us here. Paris Saint-Germain get things started. And the keeper more than equal to it. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Taken short. Big chance. Oh, good work to deny the opportunity. So into the second half, Liverpool in front, but there might still be a few twists and turns before this is over. Being pressed hard. Liverpool have the ball once more. He might be able to carve something out. And close, but offside nonetheless. Messi. Messi. Can they square the game? No worries for the keeper. Thirty minutes left for play. Well, didn't seem to be in complete control of the ball. And a corner has been awarded. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Who can they pick out? Well, they weren't able to capitalise. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Mbappe. And he might be through here. And danger still. Well, no damage done. Free kick awarded to Liverpool. Well, he can consider himself admonished, even in the absence of a yellow card. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Who can he pick out? Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Oh, no! Not 
what a moment the keeper will want to revisit. Well, he's got to pick himself up now. Well, no question about this. As you can see, this will go down as an own goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. Being egged on by the crowd. Well, it looks so promising, but a goal kicked the outcome. And so into the final five minutes. And teammates around him. Can he get one back? He can! And who's to say there's not enough time for them to level matters? It would be quite the story. Well, here it is again. 2v1 against the keeper, and they make no mistake. It's a well-taken goal in the end. They kick off again. 2-1, the current state of affairs. So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. And what can they do to stop him running at them? And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And that will be all for this game. The final whistle is sounded, and it's a defeat for PSG. Well, Derek, certainly not their best performance, was it? Just a little bit off the pace for me and obviously a disappointing result. But the key thing is they bounce back now and they can't afford a repeat performance. Well, he often cuts the figure of a thinking person's footballer and Stuart, he's thought his way throughout this match. Well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player. And the contest begins. And the keeper more than equal to it. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. taken short big chance oh good work to deny the opportunity a moment the keeper will want to revisit well he's got to pick himself up now can he get one back he can and who's to say there's not enough time for them to level matters it would be quite the story
We show them heroes. Feel it. We are the younger, the younger. We show the heroes. Building to a crescendo all week, and very shortly it will be for real. We have all the action for you live. Excitement in the Parisian air. We're at the Parc des Princes here in the French capital. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And everyone here on tenterhooks, you'd have to say, with good reason. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Liverpool. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And the PSG team looks like this. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar out wide. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And the match is underway. Oh dear, oh dear. It's an oops moment from the goalkeeper. No getting away from it. And I must say, it's always a pleasure to be at this fantastic venue, the Metropolitano in the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Atletico Madrid facing Borussia Dortmund. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? And this is the starting lineup for Atletico. Jan Oblak stands between the posts. Stefan Savic plays with Jose Maria Jimenez in the center of defense. Marcos Llorente starts alongside Koke in central midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Well, racing past his man. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. One nil then. 
Promising attack, this. Well, the supporters think it's on. Oh, great block. Kondogbia. Griezmann. Superb block. Showing.